The easiest way to make $10,000 per month in 2024 is becoming a TikTok shop affiliate. There's no doubt about it. Now, I'm not creating this video to share some theory or some concept. I'm actually seeing this working in real time. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys live results. Now, before I get into it, I wanted to provide some additional context. So at the beginning of this year, around January, my girlfriend started posting content on TikTok for the first time. She chose a specific niche and she decided to go all in and throughout the time that she's been posting i started sharing with her how i've been seeing really good results for the brand that i run specifically by having different tiktok shop affiliates promoting the products that we offer and since then it sparked an interest and she decided to start trying out tiktok shop for herself so here are her results just for yesterday as you guys can see she generated 600 dollars in commissions now mind you yesterday she didn't post any videos about a tiktok shop product the sales that are coming in yesterday are from videos she posted one or two weeks ago. I also want to show you guys the results for last month. So here you can see that if we look at from June 1st, to June 30th, she generated almost $15,000 in commissions. The crazy part is, is that majority of the commissions that she generated came from three to four videos, which is absolutely insane. So now that we went over some of the live results, let's dive into what's currently being done by the top TikTok shop affiliates. But one of the first things that I noticed is that there's really two approaches that almost all TikTok shop affiliates are usually taking. Approach one is focusing on a specific niche with their account and then promoting products related to that niche and the audience that they've built with this account. The second approach is having a more general account that isn't focused on a specific niche and then promoting a wide variety of products. The approach that my girlfriend took is actually this approach here, but it was accidentally. She just started off creating content around a specific niche and then it just so happened that one of the top selling TikTok shop products was a product that was related to her niche. And so she decided to start promoting that product on her page. And again, these are just her results. Again, I wanted to include just some screenshots here as a reference. Now I wanna go through all these examples because there's really good insights here. So here, this is one of the creators on TikTok shop and she is actually doing extremely well. She focuses on niche specific content. So her page is all about fitness and working out. She has a niche specific audience and she's promoting a niche specific product that's related to her audience. What's working for her is having her videos go viral and then the brand running her videos as an ad. And through this, in the last 30 days, she was able to get a 10% commission for all the sales that she generated and she made a total of $47,000 in commissions. Now, I have this here as a reference. So if you go to Calo Data, by the way, if you don't know what Calo Data is, it's a TikTok analytics tool. And if you're looking to get access, there's actually a link down below in the description where you can actually check it out. And there's a discount code included for you guys. Now, if you look through here, you can see that in Calo Data for the last 30 days, she generated $522,000 in sales for the product. And if we look through here, we can see that her video was went viral, but it was also ran as an ad. This is how much it generated. And then this product offers 10% commission for each unit sold. So again, if you just do a breakdown, this is what she ended up making in total for commissions, right? So again, that's just one example of a niche specific page promoting a niche specific product. So here we have another affiliate, Curve Fit Academy. You can see here she has 42,000 followers and she has a general page. Uh, all of her content is just general content. There's not a specific niche she's focused on and she's also promoting general products. Now for her, she had different videos go viral and then her videos were also used as ads. And the crazy thing about her is that in the last 10 days, she has generated $81,000 in commissions, which is absolutely insane. Now for her, I was able to verify her data from Calo data, but she specifically tweeted out her stats, right? You can see here, she shared that in the last seven days, she generated $380,000 worth of sales. And from that, she got $81,000 in commissions. And the product that she promoted was this cooling blanket, right? So here we have the next affiliate, Cool Cool Lifestyle. As you can see here, they have 18,000 followers and they're focused on a specific niche which is fashion. They're building an audience all around fashion and they're promoting products that are all fashion related, whether it's dresses or uh, bikinis or skirts, as you can see here. Now, what's even more interesting about this affiliate is that all of their commissions are being generated from the live streams that they host where they're just trying on all of these different clothing and uh, showing them off and how they fit and talking about them. And in the last 30 days, they have generated $75,000 in commissions 
all from live streams. You can see here, uh, this is a breakdown from Calo Data. We're looking at the last 30 days. You can see that all of the revenue they generated was from live streams, as you can see here. And all they're doing on their live streams, these are the products they're promoting, right? And the commissions that they give for all the products are right here. So 12%, 12%, uh, and this one does 10%. But all they're doing on these live streams is just showing off the products, how they fit, answering questions, etc. And it's just absolutely insane to see these kind of numbers being done by, you know, people just trying on clothes. These are not, this is not a brand that they own. They're just literally ordering products from different TikTok shops and trying them on and literally just sharing their experience with the products and showing off how they actually fit. And so um, I wanted to showcase that and um, point out because there's not many people that are taking advantage of doing this, right? And it's not that difficult to do some of these live streams. If you wanted to see the specific live streams, you can go on their page. They're hosting live streams literally all the time. So that's a um, cool, cool lifestyle. The next affiliate I have here is Fitbrain Biohacking. They have 55,000 followers on their page. They're focused on general content, as you can see. They have a general audience and they're promoting general products. For this affiliate, they're also focused on live streaming, right? In the last 30 days, they generated $83,000 in commissions. And here's a breakdown. So as you can see, last 30 days, they generated $830,000 in sales, all from live revenue, as you can see. And these are the products that were promoted. Majority of them came from this ice maker. To be honest, I didn't even know that there was this much demand and that people were this interested in these ice makers, but apparently they are. Um, for this ice maker, you get a 10% commission for every sale. And as you can see here, majority of the revenue came from the ice maker. Now, the crazy thing is these live streams, again, are super straightforward, right? I've spoken about this in other videos, but they're not doing anything extraordinary uh, on these live streams. They're answering questions, engaging with the audience, and uh, obviously highlighting the ownership benefits of the product. And that's about it. Now, here I have one that's pretty interesting, right? So this is another affiliate, Popo Kicks. Very small page. You can see here they have 5,600 followers. They're focused on general content. They have a general audience and they're promoting general products. Now, the crazy thing is, is that this page is making all of their commissions from live streaming. But what's also crazy is that they're doing these faceless live streams where they're never showing their face. They never show their face in their live streams or their content. And in the last 30 days, they generated $45,000 in commissions, right? As you can see, here's the data from Calo Data. Um, these are the products they promoted. And you can see here that all the revenue came from live streaming. And um, these are the products they promoted, right? They promoted this CMOS, this 15 day cleanse, this liquid IV, and these are the commissions for each one. So 30% here, 25% here, 15% here, 27% here. And again, like these live streams, this is how they look like. All they're doing is getting on and showing off the products and talking about the products and that's it. And um, yeah, I wanted to point this out because usually most of the people that host live streams, they are showing their face, right? It's not everybody that you see doing this faceless live streams. I think that you do need to be a little more advanced to be able to get away with doing these faceless live streams because it takes a lot more work to somebody to buy in from a live stream where somebody that's talking and presenting isn't even showing their face. Now, here's the next affiliate. So as you can see, we have Daniela Athena here, and she has 400,000 followers. She's focused on niche content, which is around hair care. She has a niche audience and she's promoting niche specific products. So she had videos go viral. And then also the brands took her videos and then ran them as ads. And in the last 30 days, she generated $24,000 in commissions. Here's a full breakdown again from Calo Data. This is how much revenue she generated. You can see here that her videos were ran as an ad, right? And she's promoting hair care specific products, right? Um, this is one of them here, this Wavy Talk single thermal brush, right? So here's the last affiliate that I wanted to highlight. What's Dad Eating? This page has 173,000 followers. As you can see, this is a niche specific page where he's creating niche specific content. He has a niche specific audience and then he's promoting niche specific products. In this case, again, it's all focused around food and cooking. And here's the breakdown. So he had different videos that went viral and then the brands took his video that went viral and then ran them as ads. And the breakdown is in the last 30 days, he's generated $16,000 in commissions. Here's a breakdown from Calo Data. As you can see in the last 30 days, this is the revenue that he generated, the products that he promoted. Uh, these are the videos here. As you can see, they were being ran as ads. And these are the main products that he promoted. So this Lion's Mane energy drink or just Lion's Mane drink. And then this Greens Superfood Gummy. 
and the commission here was 12 and a half percent and the commission for this one was 15 percent and so i wanted to go over and show you guys examples of all of these uh, tiktok shop affiliates and break down their numbers and the products they're promoting so you can get more context on you know what's currently working for these tiktok shop affiliates i have some additional things I wanted to point out just to wrap up. So anyone can become a TikTok shop affiliate. The only requirement that there is, is you need to have 5,000 followers on your account. But besides that, that's all you need. And to get 5,000 followers, it's actually super easy. Um, you can actually look up videos here on YouTube that actually show you how to grow from zero to 5,000 followers fairly quickly. So that's not a big roadblock. What I will say is that there are people out there that may not be comfortable in front of the camera. And that's okay. Like you don't always need to be in in front of the camera like i showed in the examples before there are content creators and affiliates right now that are making an absolute killing and they're not even showing their face they're creating this faceless content now i do think it's harder if you create faceless content but it's still doable. Now, another thing I wanted to point out is you don't need to reinvent the wheel. You can start creating content, modeling off the content that's created by these top affiliates and learn from them and then give them your own twist, right? You don't need to create brand new concepts of these videos. Like you can see what's working and model after it. Um, that's one of the things that you'll see constantly being done by many creators, even some of the top ones that are on this list. The next thing I wanted to go over is product selection. I do think that product selection is important. You'll notice that all of the top TikTok shop affiliates, they're all creating content for products that are already viral, right? There's already demand for these products. And so that's why they're choosing specifically to promote those products. The next thing I wanted to go over is strong hooks. This is very important. When you create content, you need to have people be hooked into your videos within the first three seconds to get them to actually watch the rest of the video. And so you'll notice that majority of the top performing videos have really good hooks. And so if you wanna learn more about hooks, take the time to get familiar with the top performing videos and break down what's working for them. The next thing I wanna go over is that this is a volume play. You need to approach this knowing that you may post 50 videos that are viral worthy, meaning that they're high quality, entertaining, relatable, or informational. And knowing that out of those 50 videos, 40 of them may flop and only 10 of them may actually get good views and actually generate sales. That's the name of the game, right? It's all volume. Now, the last thing I wanted to go over is paid ads. From my experience, some of the best performing videos that have generated the most sales and revenue and commissions are ones that go viral, but then are boosted with paid ads. And so what I'd recommend is that once you have videos go viral, you want to share the ad codes with the brand so that they can actually run the video as an ad. And again, this is what I'm constantly seeing being done by the top affiliates for them to actually like get their videos to one go viral, but also be pushed with paid ads. And that's how they're making like these crazy commissions. And so overall, in my opinion, this is the best way to make $10,000 per month in 2024. And the reason why I say that is because one, you can make money by obviously you know, creating content for these products. The only requirement is that you need to have 5,000 followers on TikTok. And to be honest, it's not even that difficult to grow an account to 5,000 followers. There's plenty of videos here on YouTube that will show you exactly how to do it. Um, after that, all you need to do is actually take the time to create the content, right? I obviously wanted to showcase that. And the other thing is, once you get good at being able to create content and promoting different products on TikTok shop, brands will start to reach out to you for you to help them do the same, right? Whether it's becoming an affiliate for them them or working with them to actually help them build a community of other affiliates to promote for their product or host live streams for them. One of the things that I do for the brand that I run and also for the other brands that I work with is look for content creators on an ongoing basis to one, create content that I can post organically for the page and then two, become an affiliate for the actual products that we offer and actually promote them on their own pages. And so ideally there's opportunity for, again, you to become an affiliate and make your own money promoting your own products that you choose, but also to work with other brands and help them with TikTok and TikTok shop. Because right now there is more demand for brands that wanna get on TikTok shop than there is enough quality content creators to actually create content for all of these brands. And so I wanted to create this video because I genuinely believe that this is an opportunity of a lifetime. And because I'm actively looking for more content creators for the brand that I run and also for all the brands that we work with. So it's a win-win, right? I'm helping you guys find ways that you can create more money for yourself and
and actually, you know, find this extra side hustle. And also I'm able to help the brand that I run and also the other brands that I work with find more content creators because there's really a large demand for good quality content creators. So with that said, if you're looking to make money online in 2024, you need to try out TikTok shop. If you have any questions about anything that I covered in this video, drop it in the comments down below. Also, if you're looking to get additional help, there's going to be a form down below in the description that you can fill out and actually get in contact with me and my team. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And with that said, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.